It's time to react. What's going on, you two? What's going on, you two? What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Brad Still Channel. Still reactions, yataka is where it's happening. Thank you guys for joining me on the Bradical Bandwagon today for another reaction video. And today, I am checking out the new one from Billie Eilish. This was just put up as of this recording yesterday. This is her official music video for Male Fantasy. No idea. I've not, I've not heard the song. I haven't seen the video. I have no idea what to expect. But uh, we will see momentarily what Billie Eilish has got for us. Before we do, I want to let you guys know about a new song me and my family, The Steels, have called Christmas More Than Ever. A great Christmas song for this holiday season. It's available everywhere. And the little music video that I put together is available on my channel. Here's a snippet of it now. We need the tree. We need the lights. The decorations and the music. Can there be a silent night? Let the stars shine. If you want to hear the full thing, there'll be a link to it at the end of the video as well as in the video description below. And the song is available on all digital platforms. Also, the red subscribe button is below. I have officially surpassed 130,000 subscribers. Thank you so much to everybody that put me over the hump. If you're watching and you're not subscribed, I guess we're on the road to 140K now. And if you want to help me get there, the red subscribe button is always there. And I would appreciate that very much. As for right now, I believe it is time to check out Billie Eilish male fantasy official music video. Without further ado, hitting play right now. Well, the lyrics are already intriguing from the very start, and I want to say I love how musically diverse she is, because this does not sound at all like, um, happier than ever, uh, I think was the name of that one. Uh, very different from that. All of her songs sound very unique, and I think it's awesome because it proves that an artist can do an album or a recording and not every song has to sound like it could be on pop radio. No, this could, but it doesn't sound like some of the stuff I've heard from her recently before. I can't stand the dialogue She would never be that satisfied It's a male fantasy I'm going back to therapy Oh my gosh, the the singing is fantastic. The range, that high harmony up above it, even higher than was probably sung by her too. The the lyrical content mixed with the video, so powerful. Uh, you see, even though it's the daytime, you can feel just the darkness in this house that she's in. The loneliness, the sadness. Like I said, trying to convince yourself that you hate that other person when you know you don't, and that's why this is hurting so bad. Ah, 
I love that tone right there. Used to know. Very like Ella Fitzgerald. I a call from a girl I used to know. Oh, I love that. We were inseparable years ago. Thought we'd get along, but it wasn't so. Wow, interesting lyrics right there. And it's all I think about when I'm behind the wheel. I worry this is how I'm always gonna feel. Wow. But nothing lasts, I know the deal. I love that verse right there. The lyrics all the way through the beginning. Got a call from somebody you used to know that you used to be friends with, thought you'd get along, but you don't. I think maybe hinting that you've changed. Life has changed both of you. You've gone through things now, and it's not the same as it used to be. The things that you maybe you used to have in common, you don't anymore, and so now it doesn't work anymore. Maybe just evidence that life changes you. And the things you go through, man, I love, I think about it when I'm behind the wheel. Let me go back and listen to some of that. Um, yeah. Nothing left, I know the deal. I think about it when I'm behind the wheel. I f what if this is the way it's always going to feel? This, you know, that, that's a trick our mind can play on us to tell us that how bad we're feeling right now. That's how bad we're going to feel forever. It's never going to go away. Uh, and then she ends it with, but it'll be all right. I know the deal, you know, kind of nonchalant, just like, isn't that the battle of the mind right there? Like, I know it's going to be okay, but right now it feels like it's never going to be okay. You know, she's being very open and honest about the struggle that she's going through right here. And I think it's one that we could all relate to. assuming she's got all the blank screen at the end here I, I love it's in a weird way I love the fact that the song you know it just kind of leaves you hanging right I mean we're so used to hearing stories and watching movies and hearing songs that have a happy ending where everything is resolved and we can feel good about it but sometimes you need a song to listen to when you're when you're down like this to let you know you're not alone. And I think this is one of those. I mean, doesn't really have a happy ending. She's still upset. There's no reason. Now, maybe if you listen to the album in context, maybe as it goes along, there's a little bit of a road. But as far as this song goes, there is no resolution at the end of the song. I think that can be a powerful thing because sometimes... Unfortunately, there is no happy ending. Maybe it just is something you have to just get through, you know. I think Willie Nelson used to have a song that said sometimes there are things that you don't get over. You get through. You don't get over it. You get through it. And that's and that's the kind of thing I feel right here where I feel like you've got a situation where, no, there is no happy ending to the song, but you get out how you feel. And for somebody who's going through what she's going through, they listen to the song and they f relate to her and they feel like they're not alone because we're, we're all struggling with this at some point, that loneliness, that loss, heartbreak, whatever. I love the line about, am I over you or am, am I pretending to be over you? The kind of that line in the chorus. Um, sometimes we feel pressured to pretend that we're okay. You know, I know I've been there where you feel like you got to pretend that everything's all right and you're doing great when on, in reality you're just dying. You know, thinking about the situation going on. I think it's important to feel what you feel. Feel whatever is going on and don't run away from it. Lean into it. Feel it. 
Don't try to deny it because it'll make it hurt worse. Beautiful delivery by Billie Eilish. Beautiful delivery, and she's really knocking it out of the park right now. Like I said earlier, musically diverse, everything's different. She has something for everybody, and her voice is just really beautiful, and the harmonies right there. I don't know if that was her singing all the harmonies, but the harmonies were on point. Beautiful delivery and a <laughs> perfect song for her voice, and just that storytelling voice. You can really feel the lyrics as she sings them thank you guys for joining me on the bradical bandwagon don't forget mine and my family the steals new christmas song christmas more than ever there should be a link to it on your screen as well as in the video description below the red subscribe button is also below and i wish you would consider checking that out as well help me get to 140k now thank you guys take it in soak it up bye everybody Let the stars shine.